We are starting with overnight oats. These are all the rage these days. It's an easy way to prepare your oatmeal without even cooking it, so you can just grab it and go in the morning. First, we're adding one cup of oats and then one teaspoon of chia seeds to boost up the nutrition and get lots of omega-3s in there. And now I'm adding berries. Today I'm making a raspberry cream vanilla overnight oats, but you can really add any berries or flavorings that you want. Now I'm adding one cup of almond milk. You can use soy milk or hemp milk or any type of milk you want. Just keep the ratio one to one from the milk to the oats. So here I have one cup of oats and one cup of almond milk. Now I'm gonna drizzle on some maple syrup as a natural sweetener and then mix it all up and mush up those raspberries so it's really well incorporated. Now you're gonna stick it in the fridge overnight or for at least a few hours and that's gonna make it turn into oatmeal. Ready to enjoy straight out of the fridge. Our second breakfast idea is a lush green smoothie and this is a really fun and delicious way to pack in a huge handful of spinach hearty greens so you're going to get all those nutrients without even tasting it. The way that we're going to do that is we're going to make it a tropical green smoothie. So we're adding some frozen pineapple, frozen mango, and a bunch of frozen banana along with some vanilla almond milk. And that's going to make it really creamy and sweet and flavorful. I promise you, you're not even going to taste the spinach. It's just going to make it a beautiful green smoothie that's going to make you energized and healthy throughout the day. For breakfast number three, we're making a yogurt parfait. And this is a really traditional breakfast. All you're gonna need to do is make sure that the granola is honey free and find some vegan yogurt. Here we're using coconut yogurt, but you can use soy or almond or any type of vegan yogurt you can find. Then get your favorite berries and fruits and chop them up and then you're ready to put it all together. I'm layering some yogurt and then granola. I love adding raisins for an extra chewy texture and all your fruits and then another layer of yogurt, granola, and finally you'll top it with fruits. This makes a really beautiful breakfast. You feel like you're on a Caribbean island when you're eating this and that's breakfast number three.